Oh my stars, look at all those pumps. We made a special stop at Bucky's. I've been wanting to go here and I'm just amazed by all these gas pumps. Where are we? Tupelo, Mississippi. And where are we headed? Amarillo, Texas. And we've got one item on the agenda today. Oh, visit Arkansas. <laughs> we have to drive through Arkansas, <laughs> but we're gonna make a point to stop at the Arkansas state sign. And if we happen to see a cactus, we'll take a picture of the cactus too. Here we go. Stay tuned. All right, so a quick update. How long have we been driving? Um, we left a little after seven and it is 6.20, 6.19, so no, 11, 11, hours. 11, 11 hours. What states have we gone through so far? Mississippi, Tennessee, Arkansas, Oklahoma, and now we're in Texas. What's been your favorite state? Uh, Oklahoma. Me too. Yeah, so pretty. Very great, very great. This is day what, Hannah? Day two and a half. Yes, and as you can see by the flag over Hannah, we are in Texas. We Amarillo, are Amarillo, Texas. Amarillo, Texas. We are heading out to go to where, Hannah? New Mexico. For the? Balloon Festival. Yeah! All right, we gotta go get gas. We're almost on empty. Bye! over on the side of the road at the T4 Cattle Company. Established which, in 1902. Yeah, and there's really nothing here, but it is so pretty, and we're on our way to the Balloon Fiesta. Woohoo! Hannah, what you got there? And it kind of looks like a pumpkin. I don't know. I have to borrow a hand wipe now. It's okay. Okay, we are at our first um, authentic place to eat, and it is called Sadie's, and it's cute. What time is it, Hannah? I don't know, 11.30, 11.00. .30, and it's so cold, it's 54 degrees here. But we've arrived. And supposedly there's mice here. <laughs> What day is it? Sunday. Sunday, I think it's like day three and a half. Yeah. And we stayed here last night, Hotel El Rancho. We are in Gallup, 
New Mexico. Mm -hmm. And Hannah read up on this. What is the significance of this hotel? This hotel is where all of the like old black and white movie stars would stay when they were filming nearby. So you have like John Wayne staying here, Rosalind Russell, Jimmy Stewart. So some really big names and we stayed like in one of the rooms where they stayed. So that's pretty neat. And this is on historic Route 66 too. So anyway, we are off to the Grand Canyon. <laughs> close yet so far away we'll see how long we're in line we made it through the line we're currently trying to actually find the Grand Canyon <laughs> and all we've seen is a visitor center so far What is behind you? Um, we're not sure, but we think it might be an elk. It kind of looks like a camel. Our first wildlife of the trip. As simple as it is, cactus was on my bucket list. And this will have to do. Hannah, mm -hmm. where are we at? Station 66 Italian Bistro. And we are outside in Williams, and this is our view. It is such a cute town. And the plan is to go over there for pie later. We've heard they have good pie. I've actually eaten it before, but anyway. <laughs> Update, the pie was really good, but I didn't, couldn't eat it all. Hannah, did you eat all yours? I did not. So now we're just chilling in Williams. All right, so it is six in the morning. We have just left our hotel and we are headed to where? White Sands National Park, back to New Mexico. We're headed back to New Mexico, so we're starting to backtrack now. Mm -hmm. It's been fun, Arizona was great. Mm -hmm. off, off to our new adventure. Yeah, it's our first time leaving when it's dark outside, <laughs> so. See you later. Okay, <laughs> so bright, I can't even. We are at White Sands National Monument, or what's it called? Yeah, I think it's a park. Park. It's pretty much a desert. Yeah, a desert of sand dunes. So we will let you know once we get over that yep. first. We're gonna try to sled them. Yep, all right. Oh my word. What did you think so far about, I don't even know if you're in the screen. It's I so think right. I can see Okay. It yeah, it's been pretty cool. The sledding is actually a lot of fun. You actually go much faster than I thought you would, but it's really high. Like I am drenching sweat. Yeah, see the sweat? <laughs> but, so... well, here's actually two plus things that happened to us. We didn't have to pay for the sled. A lady in the gift shop, when we were in line buying food and I was gonna buy a sled, she gave us hers. So that was plus number one. Then plus number two, it was supposed to be, I think, what did I say, $25? Yeah. To get in here. And there was no one at the gate. So we got in for free. So we really haven't paid anything other than the sandwich and the M&Ms that we bought at the <laughs> gift shop because we haven't had lunch yet. But we are going to go on a sunset tour at 530. So hopefully there'll be some pretty views tonight.
finished the sunset walking tour. Um, Hannah, what did you learn? I don't really remember anything. These are some sort of, she called them, what did she call them? Plateaus? Oh, uh, what, water shelves? But she called them something else, I think had a certain name. I remember oh, one rosemary. thing. Oh yeah, okay. rosemary or mint, depending upon, I don't know if you can see it. I learned that one of these plants, I'll insert it because I took a picture. Um, what is it called? Sopapaya? Sopapaya? Something like that. You, If you shake it, these little, are they berries? Seeds? Mm -hmm. They come out and it's food for the mouse, the field mice that live here. And then you can um, turn them into soap or something. But anyway, we're waiting for the sunset. Okay, we watched the sunset, which actually the sunset is in front of us, but this, the clouds are prettier back there. So uh, what are we doing now? I'm getting ready to head to get gas and then go to El Paso. Get some food and go to El Paso. Toodaloo. All right, so we just left El Paso. Well, yeah, we had intentions of leaving at six, but we didn't pull out of the gas station until like a little after seven because we were trying to find where we can see the Rio Grande and the Mexico-Texas border. And it is hard to find. Yeah. Like, we even asked some, a lady at the gas station where we could see the river, and she did not know. She told me to look on Google Maps. <laughs> so, we had a hard time. We were so close to yeah. seeing it. But it kept sending us the opposite direction, and we didn't want to go back to New Mexico. So. Yeah. But Hannah's gonna turn the camera on in a minute. We think, oh, we're passing the semis now. I'm thinking that some of these mountains over here are in Mexico, so we're just imagining that we're looking into Mexico because we're this close. So, it's not the... oh, you gotta turn, you gotta just manually turn it. Oh. So, we're thinking and we're hoping that somewhere over there is Mexico. But we're on our way to Waco and maybe we'll pass through, uh, well, we're going through San Antonio, so we might see the Alamo. Where are we? We are in San Antonio. And what did we just go see? We just went and saw the Alamo, so now we're on River Street. And we're going to eat. What's going on in here? This is our place that we're going to stay. <laughs> okay, can you give us a tour? All right. <laughs> this is it. <laughs> <laughs> we have the kitchen, your table, your bed, and your bathroom. Your bathroom's actually really Okay, good. I would try to get over there. Hold on, let me move my suitcase. Can you think of actually, uh, the bathroom is actually, I think it's actually useless. This is a bathroom, super cute. Should we go check out the top? All right, we're gonna go check out the top deck. They even left a little welcome note, which is sweet. We just were 
We just were a little surprised at how tiny the tiny home is. <laughs> I mean, I know it's a tiny home, but it just took us by surprise because we thought there was a bedroom and a sofa. But we're gonna make the best of this tiny home. Okay, here is the top of our tiny house. We'll have to come back up in the morning when it's daylight so we can get the full effect. But just to kind of let you know, we're on a property with other tiny homes. <laughs> Anna's calling it a compound. I'm calling it a property. So what are we doing today? We're on our way to go get breakfast and then we're going to see the silos, um, Chip and Joanne silos, and then we'll start heading towards Louisiana. All right, we'll let you know how the silos are. Where are we? We are in Monroe, Louisiana. And look at our view for dinner. We're on the bayou. And over there is uh, University of Louisiana Monroe. So, yep, we shall eat some Cajun food tonight. One minute we were at the desert, and the next minute we're sitting at the bayou. Got an oatmeal cream pie from the Silo's Bakery. Hannah got, what'd you get Hannah? An apple. And this is real life folks. We're eating it in a hotel in Louisiana. Day seven and a half outside of our hotel in Monroe, Louisiana. So every night since we were at White Sands National Park, we would leave this sled outside of our car hoping someone would steal it. And every night it's still here and we don't want to travel with it, but we don't want to litter either. So anyway, if anyone knows anybody who wants a sled, we got you covered. Hannah, all right, where did we just come out of? We just stopped at the Duck Commander, which is where, mm -hmm. like, the Strobe Duck Dynasty, their duck hall place is the other store. What did you think about it? I thought it was okay. I mean, like, we just walked into the store. We didn't, like, do the tour or anything, but mm -hmm. the store was cool. And we didn't spot anyone famous. No. So, but anyway, went in Monroe, right? Yeah. 